All right. I know you're probably thinking, this dude just made a video apologizing about his reaction videos. Now what the hell is going on? Well, let me tell you what's what's going on. Now, in the previous video, you know, I stated how my reaction views for Stranger Things or videos got accidentally, accidentally deleted. That's all true. They definitely have. They definitely got deleted by accident. Um, not lying there. Um, but, you know, after that video, after I posted it, um, I did go ahead and I watched Obi-Wan Kenobi as well as Miss Marvel. And today I started editing the videos and halfway through the videos, I was like, this is not something I want to do. This is not something I feel like I have the time for or a, or a long-term passion for. So then I'm sitting back and I'm just thinking, I'm like, then what the hell do I want to do? I know I'm a creative person. I want to make content. But what is it that I want to do for myself, for Dieris? What do I want to do for myself? And... You know, I just had to think back on this channel and how far it came from when it started off. This channel started off and was always a photography art content channel. And that's what it was. And I got around 300 subscribers just doing that. And then a lot of things happened in my life. Like I was moving around different places. Um, I was gearing up towards a new like full-time career and I just didn't have enough time for photography anymore. The passion for photography did dwindle a little bit and that happens to a lot of creatives. That happens to everyone, but I still love it. I knew I was always going to come back and pick it back up and get this camera. Although I, I'm actually going to get a new camera this year. Uh, this XT20, it's, it's been used up a lot and it's it's time to go so i might get the xt4 or if i have a whole bunch of money saved up might get the what is it the x x h s2 but whatever anyway that's for a whole nother topic um i always knew i was going to get back into it it was just when and i am gradually getting back into it um had a little fun photo shoot with a friend and i'll have a actual photo shoot coming up um two weeks from now <clears throat> actually two things I have a portrait shoot, and then I was hired uh, to do some event photography for uh, one of my old uh, makeup artists. She has like a party that's going on. She needs a photographer there, so I'm getting back into it. Um, and <clears throat> in a way, that's content that I can share to you guys. But I can't have a channel that's going to be all over the place. I just can't. I have to structure the channel to be on one topic at hand and I'm not going to have a second or third channel. There's just way too much. I got so much stuff going on that I can, I don't have the time for that. I can hardly do one channel. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, going back to just kind of thinking about what I really, really want to do with my content. I had to just think about like, do like I was working towards something and I just stopped. And then I felt like because I stopped, I gave up or I, or I lost the steam. Now I have to start all the way back over. And I was like, oh, I kind of don't want to get back into that again because it's like I know I'm going to be disappointed because like everything dropped off. People probably don't watch my channel anymore. So I was like, oh, well, maybe let me start something new and fresh that will like, you know, invigorate my 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 love for creating YouTube content. And if you guys will follow me, you know. I first started doing Let's Plays, you know, for my Twitch. Twitch streaming, I'm still doing that. I'm going to continue doing that no matter what. But I started bringing in my Let's Plays. And then I was like, okay, that's not really working. Uh, I don't know. This is a lot of work. I don't like this. And I was like, oh, reaction videos. I like doing reaction videos. Hell, I can do that. Why not? Why not do it? And lo and behold, we started doing reaction videos. But here's the thing. I wasn't doing those videos for me. 
I was not doing those videos for myself. I was doing that for gain. And the reason why I said that is because reaction videos, they can gain popular popularity very fast. Um, and they can give you traction if you're good and if you keep on with it. Um, and that's what I was, that's what I was going for. I was going for the quick money. Oh, then I can have a Patreon or whatever. And then, you know, people want to get my four reactions. I can make some more money. Now, don't get me wrong. A brother's out here trying to hustle. Everybody hustle. I have a good paying job. I have a good paying job. I'm a UX designer, but I still like to make other money. It's always good. And I tell this to everyone. It is always good to have some other passive source of income to come your way. That passive source of income could be strictly for your trips, for your traveling, for your house, your food. And then your paychecks from your main job is just there. You just have this money. So no matter how much money you're making, you should at least have one or two more passive streams of income. And that's what I'm trying to do here, to be honest. That's literally what I'm trying to do here. I'm taking what I enjoy to make some money off of it but also make you guys enjoy watching it. You know, there's a, it's a two way street. We're helping each other out basically. Um, and I was just trying to jump on the reaction thing. Cause it's like, okay, this could really work, but then I just don't really have the time to react and edit and, and just, just, just do all those things there. But also too, I just felt like reaction would not be a long term thing for me. It just, it wouldn't eventually it will stop. And then like, if I don't get on that reaction real quick or I'm not there day one, people are going to get upset, you know, and it's just like I can't deal with that because I know eventually it will stop because um, there are things that I want in life that's going to take me away from a lot of this stuff. Um, I, I'm going to have less time for it because I want those things and I'm working towards to get those things in place for my life. And that's that's what I want. And reactions just wouldn't do it. But. You know, I, I, I just had to realize, like, what do I want to do for me? And that's like a true passion. It's this, dears. It's this. This is what started this channel was this. And then I, I gave up on it or it, I guess I did gave up on it for my YouTube purposes. Um, and I'm like, no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Just because it's a long journey. See, and that's that's my thing. I I realize something that I flip flop on certain things. If something isn't gaining me the traction fast enough, if something isn't getting me to the place I want to be as quick as possible, I start to look elsewhere to see what else I can do. But I have to realize everyone gets to their goals or to certain places at their own pace and time. Some people can get it like that, and some people got to, then they get there, you know? Um, and you just don't know what type of person you are or, you know, how long it's going to take you to get there. But you got to just continue to drive. You got to keep doing it. Um, so, yeah, I took a break from photography, and then my channel just kind of, like, took a halt. And instead of just jumping straight to something else, I probably should have continued my break until I was ready to embrace photography again and get into a place where I can, you know, reorganize my channel in the same category of work. And that's what I'm doing. That is what I'm doing. Um, so instead of me chasing the quickest way to money, the quickest way for fame, I'm going to chase my my passion. And let my passion speak for itself and let my passion take me to where I want to be. So as of now, the reactions are going to stop. They are going to stop. Instead, I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing with this channel. And that's back going back to photography and art content. What that's going to be. I don't really have a set type of work set in stone. Um, we're not going to be doing any street photography anymore. There's no street photography content coming back. Cause I just don't do street photography anymore. I do strictly portraits. Now that's not to say street photography won't come in once in a while. Maybe it will. I go visit, I go to another country and I want to do some street photography there. Then hell yeah. If I decide I can make that content, but it's not strictly street for street photography. It's, it's being a creative 
photography and art. That's it. So there might be videos where it's just me talking like this and I'm talking about photography. I'm talking about art and just kind of like maybe people need help. Maybe people want to push to continue their dreams and what they want to do. That's what I do. And then occasionally I might do um, some vlogs of photo shoots that I have. Like I said, I have a photo shoot that's coming up. So I'm probably I'm going to make those into um, video content. So I'm going to get my GoPro again. I'm probably going to stream that whole entire photo shoot live on Twitch. And then when I get to editing for the YouTube, I'll trim it down and make a vlog of it. You know, so I'm still doing I'm still doing that, you know, um, and just just kind of keeping with it. And then just not I'm not going to like. I'm I'm not I'm not going to do the thing where I have to make three videos a week or something like that. Maybe one a week, two a week. I'm just I'm just going to just do what I want to do and let people find me. And if they don't, they don't, but at least I put it out there. And something I realize is that like a lot of my videos that I've had before that didn't make a lot of videos, like they made 100. I checked back 3 weeks, I mean not 3 weeks, like 3 months later and it's near 1k. Like YouTube is weird like that where things sit there but they it gradually goes slower. But out of 1k those people notice me even though it took 3 months. Those are people who want to come to your content. So I can't really just try to find the fastest route because otherwise I'm going to get burnt out and I'm just not going to be happy about it. So I do apologize for everyone who only came here for that. If you want to leave, that is perfectly fine. Um, you know, I would definitely say find somebody who really, you know, you really, really want to enjoy that content. But saying that, if you enjoy me, like watching me, then stick around. Just stick around. See what this might be. Maybe I might push photography as a new hobby for you or not even just photography something art and creative maybe something you thought about drawing singing you know sculpt sculpting anything maybe this channel will help you learn about that about yourself or get yourself back into it if you stop yourself you know um so yeah i'll just leave that to your hands there i would love for you to stay and watch my other content but i totally understand um but yeah, so there's going to be some some things change. Um, so the reaction videos are going to hide them, basically. Um, so you're not going to see them again. Uh, I'm still watching these shows. It's just I'm just going to watch them my own time. Or sometimes with friends. I used to watch TV shows with my friends. And then I was like, when I did the reaction, it would be kind of hard to do it because I already watched it. So I did kind of miss that, too. Um, but, um, yeah, I just... I just want to be honest. I just want to be honest, man. It's it's hard being a creator, man. And I said earlier how I like the flip flop, but everybody does that. Everyone jumps around to find out what sticks with them. And it's always good to do that when you're smaller. So when you're big, you you know where you're supposed to be. Like that's all we do in life. People jump around careers, jobs, schools, relationships, cities. We do that until we find the place where we know that we're going to strive and live and, and grow where we can where we can have the, the perfect soil to grow our roots. And that's what I did here. I tried something new. I tried reactions. I tried the Let's Play videos. I did it. I said I can do it. And at the end of the day, I was like, this is not for me for the long term. This is something I cannot do for the long term. But if photography content, I, I always enjoy doing that. I always enjoyed doing that. It was definitely cool, and I always want to see myself get better. And I will say, doing these reaction videos and Let's Plays, I do feel like I have gained a little bit more knowledge of editing videos, just a tad bit better. So when you see those new photography content, hopefully you guys will see that. And hopefully the people who have been following me, you're still around, still checking my videos. Hopefully you guys will be happy that I'm going back to this. Um, so, yeah. Um, but, yeah. Other than that, though, guys, um, if you guys want to catch me live on Twitch, that is where I will continue to play my video games, uh, watch some animes probably over there, uh, some other random shows, um, as well as just sitting back, talking with you guys and enjoying myself. That will all be on my Twitch at Don't Jinx Me. That is still going to happen. And also, too, um, like I said, my photography live streams there uh, will still go there as well. Um when when they come up and also to like editing as well so like you know like i said in two weeks i'm gonna have a live stream of this uh photo shoot 
go on my Twitch. And then I'm going to do another live stream of editing photos. But then I'm going to edit both of those and then bring them on to my YouTube as well, just in case you guys missed the live stream. But yeah, guys, um, <clears throat> finally got that off my chest. Um, so um, that's what's going to happen here. Apologize for those who only came here for my reaction, but hopefully you guys grew to kind of like me and want to see the other things I do with the channel again, going back to my roots and, you know, going back to where I started and where I should finish my channel, which is getting back to this. Oh, I got the hood on too. You can't even, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, guys, uh, that's it. So... Hopefully, I will see you guys at the next video, um, and let's continue that journey. So, hopefully, I see you. If not, it was a good ride. It was good knowing you, but if you want to stay, i see you later. <laughs>